He had a great question. What's your name? Carson had a great question. Coach KJ said, hey, when you when I use my whole body, am I am I just am I pulling him like this? Right? And what he was doing, okay, what he was doing is he was planting his foot in the mat and he was using his body to do this, right? But he was leaving his foot behind. Okay? Carson, what, what fix did we make? Short choppy steps, right? And this isn't my strong position. This is my strong position. Okay? So Carson went from this immediately to this. And how did it work? A lot better. Okay? So sometimes we get caught up in being these really, really strong, super muscled out meatheads, right? Because that's what people think of us. Right, but really, a lot of the time it's more about the finesse. Right, if my hand, if I just hold his hands and I'm doing this, I'm still operating with a purpose, right? So it's a lot more about the feet than it is being super strong, okay? Which leads me to my next point. All right, so, same thing out here. Popping, collected, I follow up with the second hand. Okay, what I want us to do is really, really similar. We're gonna push in a circle, okay? And then what, what, what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna lower my level and throw a foot thing. Watch, watch my feet. See that? Ready? What's what's Coach Suter doing when I throw that thing? Right? I know he's he's just playing along. This isn't like the most realistic example, but this is what he really would do. What's he doing? He's reacting, he's changing his level, okay? He's, he's trying to defend a leg attack, okay? Because if he doesn't, I'm gonna go. That leg's in my face, so I'm gonna go, okay? So I'm here, go, 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 move my feet, right? Throw this hook fake, he reacts, right? Where are my hands? They're already on him. So what am I gonna do? Pull him underneath me. I run behind for my score. Okay? So again, I'm not the strongest guy in the world, but if I get this guy bent over, hunched over his toes like this, what's your name? Rowan? Rowan could pull me down if I'm standing like this. What do you weigh, Rowan? 60 pounds. I got 100 pounds on him, right? Give or take a few. <laughs> and, uh, and Rowan can pull me down if I'm, if I'm hunched over like this. Okay, so again, I don't need to be the strongest. I need to make him react. All right, so I'm in here. Push, 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 pull, and move. And I throw this foot thing, right? Watch it again. What am I, what am I doing? I'm lowering my level. That's it. I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna say go, and I'm gonna see you guys doing this. Right? It, it doesn't have to be that complicated. It doesn't have to be that hard. Okay? All I do is lower my level and bring my head below his. He's gonna react. Well, not underneath me. I run behind for my score. One more time. Pulling. Okay. Partner reacts. Pull underneath. Go behind for my score. What's up? Um, I want to ask you guys the guys that Yep. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, yeah, you said they don't react to it. What did I say that a few minutes ago, right? When they don't react, right? I'm, I'm going. I'm just. Boom, boom. Okay? I'm going. And that's what makes it dangerous. He said, hey, I wrestle big guys and I've done this before and they don't react. All right. You're going to have the cojones to go get it then. Right? Recognize this guy standing in front of me. I'm in a better position than him. I'm going to go. Boom. I'm attacking that double leg. Now, the second time around, he's going to think, what's your name? 
he's going to think, holy crap, Aiden just knocked the wind out of me with a nasty double leg. Right? I'm not going to let that happen again. So then you get in the same position. You push, you pull. He thinks, I'm not letting this guy double leg me again. Boom, he reacts. Now I go. And guess what? The third time. What happens the third time? He has no freaking clue because I just hit him with both. So now it looks like this. I do whatever I want. I'm scared, yeah. No. Don't know what's going on. Right? So I, I can do that with one hand. KJ and I are probably the same strength level. He might be a little stronger than me. He's been lifting more. Okay? But it's the footwork. The getting him to react that allows me to be dominant in those positions. A little bit, a little bit. You guys sometimes, not you guys specifically, but people I work with get confused and they go like this. And now I'm in this lunge position and I lose all power unless I'm going forward, right? But if this guy's in a good position and I go forward, I'm not getting anywhere. So when I, when I lower my level, it's, it's a little bit forward, but it's, it's mostly to sell the thing, right? I'm winning a damn Oscar with this fake, right? You can't do this, because it's, it's fake. No pun intended, but that's fake. Like, is that, no one's gonna react to that, okay? When I throw this fake, I lower my level, I bring my head down, and my foot looks like I'm coming forward, right? How far do you think that moves? Three, four inches, not very. Okay, and I'm not stopping, right? I'm, I'm finessing, right? Okay, simple enough. You guys think you got this? One more. When you're doing it, do you have like a lot of weight? No, no weight. No weight on this foot. I mean, obviously there's a little weight, but, but look, I can, I can remove it at will, okay? Essentially, it's not stuck in the sand. Exactly. You're taking that pressure, but then you're immediately moving it. Yep. Right. You guys got it? Right. One, two, three.